Hi, this is Nick in 3WG, and I wanted to give you a, a quick demo of what I've been playing with. I got Google Glass. Uh, for anyone who's unfamiliar, this is a uh, wearable computer, basically. So there's a an entire Android system built into this side unit right here that uh, sits on your face. These go on your nose, of course, and you look into this little prism. It shows you a screen. It's not on right now. If I turn it on, you might barely be able to see down in there. It's probably not going to focus on it. But um, right there it has the clock as well as um, two words down at the bottom. If you say those words, it wakes the device up and gives you a menu. So for example, if I say right now, OK Glass, then it wakes up and it just showed me the menu. Now because you can't see it here, what if I can do it this way? Doesn't look like it. But there is an option. So what I'm going to do is um, in the Glass app on my phone here, I can start up a screencast. So this is what is being displayed inside Glass right now. So if I say OK Glass, it gives me the list and, and actually as I move this up and down you can see the menu moving so as you tilt your head up and down you can look around. So I've been playing with the glass development kit. Kill that. And uh, I wanted to show you a couple apps. Um, first one here, let's wake it up. Stop this timer. And let's do OK Glass Show GMT. So this is a basic uh, UTC clock here. That's the first one. OK Glass Show Grid Square. So this started up the GPS on the glass itself. And um, I'm inside. Oh, but there it is. So that's my current grid here in uh, Sunnyvale, California. And as I move around, this, uh, the GPS is constantly updating and it's, uh, it's going to update this grid square here. And uh, the battery on this camera might die here in a moment, but uh, if it does, I'll just restart later. Let's close that app. And the next one, OK Glass, show DX spots. So these are the uh, latest five DX spots from uh, DXWatch.com, uh, and this updates every 30 seconds. And it's uh, the top one is the latest one, and then the last five chronologically. Now let me uh, I'm going to pause the video and uh, show you a setup in the other room in just a second. Okay, here I have a KX3. Uh, with a bunch of cables plugged into it. Those cables are plugged into this pig remote right here that uh, is being used for development which is sitting on top of two Motorola Max tracks and a, uh, a repeater. But anyway, the, uh, the pig remote is what we're looking at here. So we have um, Ethernet coming in the back and then the two audio cables and the serial cable uh, which are all going into the radio. Uh, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to control this radio with Google Glass. All right, we're back here at the phone looking at the screen on glass. So let's wake it up. OK, glass. Start pigtail. So just now it initiated a network connection. This has Wi-Fi built in. So it's, uh, it's talking over the network to the pig remote, which is sending commands out its serial port to query frequency and mode right now. now if I swipe my finger forward here on the side, You'll see we went up to 14001, 2, 3. So there's a touchpad on the side here, and there's several gestures you can use. If I go back, we're going down in frequency. If I use two fingers on the side, you can hear the relays click in the other room, and we're going up a band. It's up another band. And I can go back down with two fingers. It's 
It's a little awkward when it's not on your head. Uh, let's see, if I tap, I can pull up a menu. Change modes here. Let's go to lower sideband or CW. And another thing I can do here is if I tap with two fingers, we're now transmitting. Uh, so we're in TX. The, the little red TX light is on on the radio right now. Tap again with two fingers. And we are now back in receive mode. I don't have the audio built into this yet. Uh, audio is in pig remote, and it's just a matter of making a voice over IP phone call, which should work on this. Um, it does have a speaker in it. It has a bone conducting speaker right here, which is kind of neat. It actually um, it vibrates your uh, just the bone just above your ear, so you can hear it inside your head. Um, it does have a microphone on it up here somewhere. There's a microphone. So you can, uh, it, it does Bluetooth uh, phone calls as well. It also has a, a headphone, a mono headphone jack you can plug in. This is actually a micro SD, but you can plug in a mono headset. They also have a stereo headset. So that's, uh, that's what I've been playing with. Those are the four apps I've been uh, messing around with with the, uh, the Glass Development Kit. And uh, I have several other things I want to try, but, uh, but it's quite a bit of fun. So let me just kill this guy. And that's that. So uh, leave me a note and let me know what you think.